See, Demetrius Johnson's passing continues to leave its mark on a city he served and loved so much. He was an icon who was more than just an athlete, but also a much needed voice in the lives of young people. Johnson died on Christmas Eve from heart complications. Tonight, our Melanie Johnson walks us through the legacy he leaves behind and the lives he saved along the way. When God made him, he threw away the, threw away the blueprint and there was only one D-Day. His presence unmatched and his work undeniable. Pictures of Demetrius DJ Johnson decorate the wall at this community center on Union Boulevard. When he started really feeling ill, he was out buying toys for kids. He's out buying toys. That's what he did. A place Willie Metcalf tells News 4 is still open only because of one phone call to Demetrius Johnson. He came through uh, for me. He came through for the community in a big way. For years, it has been the hub for the Demetrius Johnson Foundation. He gave kids experiences that they would never have had if had, they had not met him. He would take busloads of kids to Mizzou games. We go to Cardinal baseball games. The Universal Circus came to town and the Universal Circus would come here to the community center. Responsible for feeding hungry families, students going to college and giving people a fresh start. Young men coming out of prison, he would help them to find jobs. A man many considered a hero, even credited for saving Willie's life. DJ told me he didn't give me a choice, but I'm going to take you to the hospital right now. And if he had not taken me to the hospital that night, I don't know where I would be to this day. Gone at 61 years old, the decorated NFL and Mizzou football player died on Christmas Eve. Oh, wow. He's a brother, a partner, a conscience. He leaves behind a wife of 34 years, two daughters, a son, and a city that looked to him as their champion. His legacy will continue through the foundation helping today's youth towards a better tomorrow. We would never be able to fill his shoes, but uh, we're gonna make it possible for kids to fulfill their dreams. A memorial service will take place here at the Chaffetz Arena on Monday. It is open to the public. The family is asking anyone that wants to make contributions to send them to the Demetrius Johnson Foundation. Melanie Johnson, News 4. That service will be Monday at noon. The formal procession will take place from the Demetrius Johnson Foundation on Union Boulevard to Memorial at Chaffetz Arena.